we're going to turn those strips of fabric into bias tape. And the trick for doing this is to have what's called a bias tape jig. So these are commercially available, but they're also being printed by 3D printers all over the country. The files are available online. If um, you know someone with a 3D printer who can make you one, um, what you want them to print is the four centimeter, which equates to one and a half inch, because again, one and a half inch is the size strip that we have. There's also a wider one available for other uses, but we're gonna stick with the four centimeter. I have one in pink that I'm gonna use right here. And um, the, the key is to pair this with a flat iron. So a ha flat iron intended for straightening hair is gonna be a fantastic tool for quickly um, ironing this piece instead of using a conventional iron. It's gonna save a lot of time. So what we're gonna do, I have found it easiest to feed this strip into the bias tape maker that I have anyway, by just cutting, oof, I didn't do a great job of that, but cutting the edges off. And then you're gonna stick it in this end, the wider end. Till it starts coming through the other side. Yep, there it comes. And then you're gonna pull it out. And we're gonna grab that flat iron. We're gonna press it and then eventually we're gonna, once we have a safe edge to grab, we're just gonna pull it through. So I'm just pulling it through and it's being pressed while I pull. And now we have bias tape, magic. And I should have mentioned that I learned this tip from the many fabulous Facebook mass groups that are out there. So I learned this from Mary Jo Ernst, and I think she reposted it from Lisa Spark. So kudos to both of you for making up the rare of this trick. This is a pretty great trick.